China's involvement in Africa's infrastructure and way of doing business could be attributed to the United States' failure in maintaining strategic partnership with Africa. This comment was made by the former United States Ambassador Robin Sanders following U.S. Secretary of State Rex Tillerson's recent visit to Africa. Ms. Sanders said Mr. Tillerson's comment concerning China's presence on the continent underestimates the sophistication of Africa's leaders in forming strategic partnerships. She is hopeful the visit would rekindle a renewed interest for America. She commended America's support in helping Nigeria rescue the abducted Dutch girls. I have absolutely no problem with the strategic partnerships, the engagement. I actually think China um, is doing a, a very good job of focusing on infrastructure development, uh, what they're doing in East Africa, building railroads and things that we don't do. And it's our fault that we're not doing those. So I'm not in that corner. I know there are Americans who you know, have that viewpoint. I'm not one of those. I think I always give China credit for its involvement, for its leadership. I'm not saying that everything they do I agree with, but I certainly think they're, they have a, a deeper viewpoint on how they want to engage, and they look like they're engaged for the long term. And we don't have that perception here, and I'd like to see us change that. Well, I think there were some lessons learned from Chibuk for not only Nigeria, but certainly the U.S. and other partners. Um, and I'm hoping that uh, we'll have a lot more success than we had with the, the Chibuk uh, girls. Uh, and that's still a very, very delicate and sad issue. And um, I, you know, I, I give credit to the, uh, uh, the movements here in Nigeria that have kept that issue alive because it's extremely, Bring Back Our Girls has uh, really done a terrific job. So I'm hoping that the lessons that, and mistakes that were made on that one from both, from all sides, from everyone's side, don't get made uh, with the recent abductions. And I'm hoping that through joint intelligence sharing and uh, joint operations that they'll be able to find all of the girls if possible and hopefully all of the girls.